A great shakeout here and around the world as millions prepare for the big one. On this anniversary of the 1989 Loma Prieta quake, children climbed under their desks as California's governor announced a new way to warn people before an earthquake happens. News 8's Shannon Handy joins us live from the Skyline area with more on the great shakeout and how this new technology works. Shannon? Marcella and Alicia, we're here at Freeze Elementary School, one of several schools within San Diego that took part in this morning's drill. About 300 students attend this campus. Now, it's not only the 30th anniversary of the Loma Prieta quake, but it's also a day that state officials have long planned for as the My Shake app is finally ready to go. Attention staff and students, this is an earthquake drill. At 1017 a.m. Thursday, students at Freeze Elementary in San Diego's Skyline neighborhood joined millions across the state and world in ducking, covering, and holding on as part of the great shakeout. This is very important because living in California, we never know when an earthquake will happen, and all staff and students need to know what to do in that event. The drill lasted 60 seconds, at which point students were told to evacuate outside. The Great Shakeout is done annually, but this one falls on the same day California's governor unveiled an earthquake alert system officials have spent years working on. Today, uh, we are making a big leap forward in terms of focusing attention on prevention. Called MyShake, the UC Berkeley design app uses sensors in the ground to warn people about an earthquake seconds before it happens, giving you time to protect yourself and cities the ability to do things like stop elevators or trains. Japan and Mexico have similar programs in place, but Governor Gavin Newsom says nothing quite like this. We feel we are on the leading and cutting edge in terms of the ability to utilize this technology. The announcement comes on the 30th anniversary of the Loma Prieta quake, which measured 6.9 and rattled San Francisco's Bay Area. Newsom and others say when faced with this type of destruction, seconds count. You download that app, we now have another point of contact, and we are now all part of this remarkable capacity to iterate, to experiment, to advance science in real time to make us all more safe. And again, it's called the MyShake app. And if you look on it right now, it says there are more than 480,000 users. That means more than 480,000 people have downloaded the app. The goal, of course, by state officials is to have everyone with a cell phone download this app. And that alert you will hear is similar to the same notification system used by Amber Alert. Back to you. Great to see that up and running. Thanks, Shannon. So is California earthquake ready or not? Coming up in our second half hour, we take an in-depth look at how the shake alert system actually works. But first, we'd like to hear from you. How prepared are you in the event of a major earthquake? Very prepared, somewhat prepared, or not prepared at all? That's our web poll question tonight. You can weigh in by going to cbs8.com slash vote, or you can use our news eight app. I'm looking at the results. I think uh, most people fall right there in the middle. 54% are somewhat prepared. But what does that mean somewhat prepared? Like you have a few bottles of water, but maybe not documents, right? I think that uh, the majority of us <laughs> fall in that category. Yeah. We're going to give you if you're watching some time to vote and then we'll update you with the new results a little later in the newscast.